Let's open up item 7 on slope arrows. But Teach is pitching one very nice perpendicular angle upwards. What if? What if in your design, you really want a funky roof? Select this roof, click on Edit Footprint. Now, you see under here in Shapes Creation, you see a slope arrow. We are going to plonk that slope arrow this way. And then you pay attention to this. Okay, before we finish the job, huh? I want you to pay attention to height offset at tail. The number here at the moment is zero. What does this mean? Hey, at this point here is zero. Okay. Second part you pay attention to is this height offset at hip. Hip is 3000. So it's this point here, it will be three meters. That's the difference in section. When done, right? You will finish the job and you click finish. Check this out. All right, this one. So we can make changes to it after that. After you select this, oh, I really don't like the pitch too much. Maybe we can tweak this. So you select this slope arrow again, go to edit, footprint, edit the roof, select this. Ah, it's too low. Let's make it 6,000 instead. All right, and we finish the job. Now you see that the pitch is way more inclined this way, like that. Way more pronounced, if not exaggerated. Next, instead of uh, this one, still can be classified as a mono pitch, uh, as a one pitch, one way pitch. Next, we select this. We edit the footprint now, same thing, we use the slope arrow. This time out, I'm going to plonk one here to here. And then I'll use the slope arrow again, I'll plonk another one from here to me here. Like that. Guess what? I have finished the job and look at how the roof now forms up this way. So, next. The third one, the killer. You see down here on this roof example, you already see some degree of changes. This one is, I don't know how many way already. So one way pitch here, two way pitch here. You have three way here, you have four way here, but small little shapes like that, that can be done, okay? And then I'm, on top of that, we're going to add something here as well. We are going to make it pitch up this way. And then so that we can form a little triangle like that, a pitch again. Okay, that's the battle plan. Now, to do this, select this roof here. Before we do anything, select the sunglasses here, the glasses here, and click isolate element. So you don't have to deal with everything. You just deal with the one particular roof. I find this to be easier this way. All right. Now after this, click on Edit Footprint now. And I'm going to split this single line to multiple line segments. In this case, triple line segments. How to do this? Remember, you learn about the split element command. You click on this. And then you move all the way the scalpel to 2 meters. One click, move the scalpel from here to here, one click. After that, select this line and take away the defined slope. Don't make this a defined slope. These two will remain defined as a slope because they need to flow up here and they need to flow up this way as well, okay? But this one, we want it to move this way instead. So therefore, we will use the slope arrow now. And when we snap, okay, remember you can control the snap, right? What key must I do if I want to snap to end point? 
S E. Okay, snap to end point is S E. Then I want to force it to snap to midpoint. What is the key? S M to snap to the midpoint so that it will lock on to the midpoint of the line only. This is one. And then I will use another slope arrow here. Again, snap to end point. And then snap to midpoint here. So I have technically now two arrows facing and touching each other like that. With this, all right, in order for it to form up properly, I am going to change the number, right, at the height offset at height to 100 mm only. I will change this one to 100 mm only. Two of this. That means this is zero. These locations are zero. At this location, though, this is 100 height. 100 mm height. With this, then I click finish the job. You notice now there's an additional pitch happening here. This one very number specific. Eh? If I key in the wrong value, however, you will find that the roof now looks funny. If I change it to 500, it now looks like an open halfway situation. It does, the pitch does not close off properly or the shapes changes. All right. Now to fix everything back and revert, please remember to click on the sunglasses here and reset the temporary height and isolate command like this. So you have a roof that will work like that. Okay.